Hey artists! Today we're going to learn how to decipher these nasty descriptions on all photography lenses. So we're going to start by talking about two different types of lenses, um, prime and zoom lenses. And the difference is really simple. One can zoom and the other is a fixed focal length. And so here are examples typically of each. Uh, you know, I use a Sony, so that's why um, you know, we're going to talk about Sony lenses today. So if we zoom in on the letterings on this particular lens, we see that there's three distinctive set of information here. Lens mount type, maximum aperture, and focal length. And I know that this is a fixed focal length. This is a prime lens because it does not have a zoom capability at all. And so if we take a look at another lens that we have, this is a zoom lens. And again, here's four different types of sets of information. So we have the lens mount type, maximum aperture range, a zoom focal length range, and then class information and motor kind and other types of information that are like that. And again, this will vary between camera manufacturer and camera manufacturer about what these letters are and what they mean specifically. And then here are examples of three typical lenses that you can find. And once you know that, you can kind of understand that it's aperture and, and focal length range. All right, let's talk about the lens ring size. Now, this is uh, on the front of your lens where the glass element is, and it, it's the... It's designated in millimeters and it has like this uh, weird circle with a slash in front of it indicating that this is the uh, diameter of your lens frontature. This is what you would need to use to buy a new um, filter or lens cap. And then here we have a typical Sony lens on the front and it has a whole bunch of different information. We've already talked about the bottom part um, and we've talked about the top right part. Uh, 55 millimeters of diameter for if you need to buy a filter, you need to buy a new lens cap, that's it. Now let's talk about the top left part. There's a whole bunch of different numbers here that are really easy once you understand them. So let's dig into them a little bit deeper. We'll find out what they mean. So here, let's write this out. And you see two distinct set of numbers here. It's a range. And all they did was just take the metric and translate it into standard. I'm not sure why they did it here and not for all the other measurements, but here you go. So the first one is minimum focal distance at minimum focal length. And that pretty much just says the distance between the lens and the subject that you're trying to focus on. This is the minimum distance it can do when you're zoomed all the way out. All right. And the second number here is the minimum focal distance at the maximum focal length. So again, this is the minimum distance between the lens and the subject you're trying to focus on to at most zoomed in. And that's pretty much it. Uh, there's a lot of other smaller details uh, that, that are involved with lenses and they're, they differ from manufacturer to manufacturer, but this is really the basics. This is everything that you really need to know about these different types of lenses. Thank you for watching. Go out there and make some art.